Hey, it's so funny. I recorded like, I don't know, six minutes of a video and then I realized it wasn't recording. So, I am restarting this. So, um, today is Tuesday, October 3rd. And um, I'm actually walking downtown because I need to reprint a document. I was down here originally. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a printer with me. So I can't print documents. I have to go down and use FedEx office or go to the library and print it. Um, it's so frustrating. I actually almost brought, um, actually almost brought the, my printer from home but I didn't, and I'm uh, kicking myself. I wish that I would have. Um, back in June, I think it was June, we, when we got back from Puerto Rico and we were back home in Texas, we packed up just a couple things and thing, like clothes and stuff for a couple of months because we thought that our home would be done in, uh, well, we thought maybe two months maximum. So we were just gonna hang out in Colorado Springs during that time. But unfortunately, it has pushed month after month after month, which is really frustrating, but I'll be patient. And I know it's all in God's timing. Um, that's the same thing with you guys, Warren and Clara. Um, it's all in God's timing and I'm just trusting as you can see, I didn't even do my hair today because I had so much stuff going on. I just went ahead and put it on my head um, because I have to prioritize my things that I do throughout the day. And I just want you to, and my priority, number one is you guys. Um, that's the appellate case that I am representing myself in as my own attorney. And then also praying for you. Praying is number one. And... I just want you to know that there are a lot of people praying for you, um, both you and Warren and Clara, they're praying for you, I'm praying for you, we're praying for um, everyone involved in this situation. I believe that there can be redemption of even the people who have been dishonest. Um, I'm praying that they'll fear God more than they'll fear man. I mean, it's as simple as that. So. Um, Anyway, so I'm on my way to go print some documents that I need to send to the Oregon Appellate Court. I need to supplement the record um, that is currently before the Oregon Appellate Court. So I need to request for the court to allow me to add some things to the record. Um, so today, for memory, I was like, okay, what kind of memory? Um, is like on the top of my mind and a memory uh, a really wonderful memory that I have with you guys um, is when we used to ride bikes um, we rode bikes all over the place but there were times especially in the spring and in the fall where I would ride your I would ride my bike with you guys to school and um, and then we would come home from school, so I would ride my bike. So you guys obviously would leave your bikes at school um, behind the gate. I don't think you ever lock it up. Maybe Warren would lock it up. And then, actually, yeah, I think he did. Um, and then I would ride my bike back after school to, to be able to ride home with you guys. And sometimes we would stop at the gas station. I don't know if you guys remember, we stop at the Reed Market gas station and get candy or ice cream or whatever it was um, that we wanted, some sort of a snack and splurge and then go home. Sometimes we would go to the Reed, that park. I, can't, I don't think it was Reed Market Park, but... Um, it was the park there at the senior center and we'd go there too and we'd ride home and I loved it when Clara first started going. Um, it was so cute. I remember she had, I think Warren's old bike and it had very small wheels on it. So it didn't go as fast and as far as my bike and Warren's bike. And we would have to slow down 
and then I finally realized I'm like Clara's pedaling fast but because her wheels and her bike is so small um, she wouldn't go as far as we would and as fast so we would have to wait for her so that was my memory um, I miss riding bikes with you guys I miss hanging out with you I miss reading to you I miss um, praying over you guys at nighttime I miss quoting um, biblical um, identity in Christ scriptures over you before bed I am so grateful for every single memory and every single moment that I had with you guys and I am believing I am believing because I have the authority of King Jesus Jesus Christ I have the mind of Jesus Christ and so do you guys so I'm going to be believing it is we are in a new era and I've been seeing so many miracles um, which are absolutely awesome all over our nation so I'm just gonna speak right now I'm gonna pray real quickly but I'm gonna speak right now um, just justice and victory of course there's an ambulance oh a fire truck coming um, Alright, it's a fire truck. Here, I'll let you get it. Oh, boy. It's going to the library. That's where I was headed. Oh, alright. Well, I guess I could probably take some time. But, um,. I'm just going to be believing for a miracle, just like I know that others have been speaking. Because we have...